The Difference Between Creation and Emanation by Dave Marsland of Cardiff Theosophical Society. In the realm of metaphysics and theology, the concept of creation and emanation have been the subject of extensive philosophical inquiry and debate. Both concepts seek to address the fundamental question of how the cosmos and its various phenomena came into existence, yet they offer distinct perspectives on the nature of this process. To understand the difference between creation and emanation, it is essential to examine their historical origins and development within the context of various philosophical and religious traditions. The concept of creation holds significant importance in the Abrahamic religions, particularly within the Judeo-Christian tradition, where it is central to the understanding of God as the ultimate source of all existence. In the book of Genesis, the act of creation is depicted as a deliberate and purposeful act of divine will, wherein God brings the world into being ex nihilo, or out of nothing. On the other hand, the concept of emanation has its roots in ancient philosophical traditions, most notably in Neoplatonism, particularly in the writing of Plotinus. In Neoplatonic thought, emanation is understood as a process by which the ultimate reality, often referred to as the one or the good, generates a series of successive levels of existence, each emanating from the divine source in a hierarchical fashion. This concept of emanation was further elaborated upon by later Neoplatonist thinkers such as Proclus and Plotinus's student Porphyry. The distinction between creation and emanation carries profound philosophical implications concerning the nature of the divine, the relationship between the creator and the created, and the structure of reality itself. In the case of creation, the emphasis is placed on the radical distinction between the creator and the created, wherein God stands apart from the world as its transcendent and sovereign originator. This understanding of creation raises questions regarding the nature of divine agency, the problem of evil, and the ontological status of the created order. Conversely, the concept of emanation implies a more intimate and interconnected relationship between the divine and the manifest universe. Within a framework of emanation, the created realm is seen as an outflow of effusion of the divine, with each level of reality retaining a resemblance to its source as it descends the ontological hierarchy. This perspective engenders a holistic view of reality, wherein all beings are understood as participating in various degrees of divine likeness and sharing in the unity of the ultimate source. In theological discourse, the distinction between creation and emanation has significant implications for the understanding of God's relationship to the world, the nature of divine providence and the purpose of human existence. Within the framework of creation, the world is conceived as the product of God's free and sovereign will, brought into existence for a specific purpose in accordance with divine wisdom and goodness. This understanding of creation underscores the absolute dependence of the created order on its transcendent creator and the moral responsibility of human beings towards their creator and fellow creatures. In contrast, the concept of emanation introduces a different perspective on the divine creative process, emphasising the idea of a continuous and interconnected unfolding of reality from the divine source. Within this framework, the world is seen as an expression of the divine abundance and generosity, wherein all beings participate in the divine life and contribute to the harmonious unity of the cosmic whole. This view of emanation raises questions regarding the nature of divine immanence, the problem of divine transcendence, and the role of human beings in the cosmic drama. In summary, the concepts of creation and emanation represent two distinct yet interconnected ways of understanding the origin and nature of the universe. 
While creation emphasizes the radical distinction between the creator and the created, emanation highlights the interconnectedness and continuity between the divine and the manifest world. Both concepts offer rich insights into the nature of reality, the divine attributes and the human condition, inviting further philosophical and theological reflection on the mysteries of existence.